Hey guys, how you doing? Coming today just to show you um, what I'm making and I'm making some crunch wrap. I'm gonna show you what I have here. I have my meat grounding and all the ingredients here. So I have some seasoning, taco seasoning right here. I get that at the store called Stu Leonard's um, because that way I can have it for a while. We like tacos, so. Then I have some cheese here. So right now I'm cutting up the tomato. I'm gonna just dice that up. I only use one because most people in this house don't like tomato, but I do. So I put it in mine. So I just dice it up in little chunks, little squares while I'm finishing um, the seasoning here and the meat, grounding it up. Put that up a little higher just to mix it up. So the kids love tacos, but we started getting sometimes when we're on a run out and about getting crunch wraps because they went on sale for three bucks. So they actually started liking them. So I figured, hey, why not make them at home? Because they're really easy, not much to do. A little more work than tacos, but just a little more filling as well. And also includes a hard taco, not just a soft taco. You hear the kids in the background, they're just kind of hanging out while I cook. Work. They're all ready to eat, so <laughs> they definitely want to eat. So. Zena likes her shredded cheese, so I've just been giving her a little bit to satisfy her while I do this. That's it for now, okay? Hold on. Well, you can't have too much. Eat a lot because you need to eat it with your food. We have to save some. No, no, no. Turn that off. Very Stop. 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 I know, Papa. It's a coming. We're gonna get you some ground meat here. I'll let it cool off a minute. That's about done. Now we're going to start putting them together. Cut up the tomato already, so that's done. So just basically little chunks of tomato. And oh, also I add in sour cream, and I like to get this one because it just easy opens and easy squeezes out for the kids if they want it or not. They can put it on. And I also use these, which are called tostados and that's like a circle hard taco that's gonna go in the middle and actually get those at all these and they're really cheap cheap i can link it in the description box below because they're only about a dollar so it's a good deal and then i also like to just use a little bit of avocado on the side because we like that so i sliced my avocado already here it is looking good so what I do is I like to slice it down three ways like that and then just make a little cubes out of it. It works good for the kids too. They like to uh, eat it that way. I'm gonna turn this on low because it's pretty much all set. We'll just start putting them together.
right guys, I'm back to show you how we put it together. So this is the bottom. I just put a little bit of the cheese sauce on here. And then what I do is I put the meat. You can use ground beef, you can use chicken, you can use steak, whatever you prefer. Tonight I'm just doing the regular ground meat. And I'm going to just put that, take one of the tostados, which is the round hard shell taco, put it right over top. That's when I'm gonna put some lettuce, some cheese, and some of the sour cream if you like that. If you don't, you can just leave that out. just some tomato and me and my fiance like avocado so we'll put in that as well because that makes it even better all right so then we just take this soft taco we put it over top and then we just fold the edges in. And if you don't have a skillet, I'm using a skillet, flat skillet to do this. You can also use just a frying pan and you just line it with a tiny little bit of olive oil or some olive oil or um, canola oil. And then that way after you wrap it up, basically what you want to do is just like create a seal with it. So you're going to wrap it all up in and then you're gonna put it on this and that's how it turns out just like that so guys thanks for watching again i'm tiffany i'm from the rosa fam just wanted to show you a nice quick dinner that we do and i hope you like it don't forget thumbs up subscribe and comment down below and don't forget to turn on those auto notifications all right See you next time on the Rosa Fam.